What's good? It's your boy T Storms, aka JB Taylor. Yo, I know I've been going for a minute, man. <laughs> my bad, y'all, for all my people who follow me, all my people who watch my trucking videos. It's just been a lot going on. You know what I'm saying? I've been working, obviously, y'all know how I do when it comes to the work thing. But um, I've also been out of work for about a month and a half. I got into an accident. Not in the truck, in my personal vehicle. I got hit. Um, I messed my back up. So that, you know, that had me messed up for a while too. Um, but again, my bad, y'all, because I know I've been going for a minute. It's probably been at least a month, two, maybe even three since I uploaded something for y'all. Um, so I just want to give y'all an update. I appreciate all the comments, all the watches, man. Please, please continue to watch my videos. Like and subscribe them. You know, like, subscribe, share them, get it out there, and then I can continue. That'll motivate me to make more videos for y'all about the whole truck industry and what I do in it and what I feel is what you should do in the truck industry. Again, it's really up to you as far as over the road, LTL, doing this, you know, driving for somebody like Cisco or, you know, whatever you want to do in the trucking business, there's a lot of money to be made in the trucking business. Um, but first, I want to shout out a couple people. Again, all the people who uh, comment on my on my uh, on my videos, like my videos, who subscribe to my page, I really appreciate y'all. And anybody who else who watches this video, some of my videos got, I think, almost two thousand live views, thousand four five hundred. Man, come on, man, let me get some likes on those. Just like my videos if you like them. Um, please give me a like. Leave a comment. Ask your questions if you're trying to get in the, into the business of trucking and you know trucking in general or any other questions y'all got about me or whatever you know just just hit me up on there and let me know um so yeah for one i want to address a couple questions i know some people been asking about like what you need to get in the ltl business for one thing you're gonna need you're gonna need your um tank you're gonna need your hazmat endorsement that's and if for any trucker out there you should get your hazmat endorsement anyway just so you have that under your belt so that when you uh, do apply, you got your hazmat. And hazmat, a lot of carriers are carrying it nowadays, man. Hazmat is on a lot of things, man. So definitely want to get your hazmat, especially for LTL. You're going to need it. You also are going to need your tankers. And no, we don't drive those like gas tanks or the, or the liquid tanks. But we have like, uh, we have containers in our truck with liquid. So it's considered, you need your tanker to, to pull that stuff. So you definitely gonna wanna get your tankers and definitely gonna need your tankers. And you also need your doubles and your triples. Doubles and triples are when you pull like uh, two trailers, um, sometimes three, like in the West Coast and a couple other places they pull three. But out here where I'm at on the East Coast, we pull two trailers, that's the most you could pull out here legally. Um, so yeah, that's, what, that's three things you definitely gonna need in the LTL business. You're gonna need your tanker, you're gonna need your hazmat, and you're gonna need your triples and doubles. Definitely gonna need all three of those things, man. And uh, so get them. It's not that hard. You go down to your local DMV. You gotta take a test. You know. Um, let me know if you need help finding a way to study for these, because I'll let you know. I can. I'll just leave your comments and I'll answer them. Um, but it's not that hard. You study for your hazmat. You study for your tanker, and you study for your doubles. I did all three at the same time. I think I filled my triples and doubles and I had to come back and take that, so I took that twice. But everything else, I just did all at the same time, so it's really not that hard. Um, so yeah, as y'all can hear, man, I don't know if y'all like rap, but I got that Benny the Butcher. Benny the Butcher is one of the hardest rappers out right now. That's what I listen to. I listen to other stuff too, but Benny's, Benny's fire, man. If you into hip hop, um, shout out to the Giants, by the way. I know it's, I'm gonna get a lot of haters for that, but shout out to the Giants, man. I'm a diehard Giants fan. Shout out to Shaquan Barkley, Danny Dimes, Shepard, Slayton, Ingram, and all of those guys, man. Um, but yeah, back to the trucking. So, <laughs> I remember before in one of my videos, I think I said I was I, I like the city better. Um, I'm going to be honest with y'all, man. I worked the city for, I think I've been there for like nine, ten months now. Hey, the city's real, man. Pedal. A lot, some people call it pedaling. It's when you go from, you know, you're doing residentials, you're doing commercial stuff, you're doing mom and pops. I mean, you name it, we deliver it. We deliver there. We deliver everything, man. I, like that. That's another question. Like you want, if you want to know what an LTL carrier delivers, 
Bro, we deliver everything. <laughs> like, I mean everything. I've seen a lot of stuff in my trucks. So yeah, man, the the, the pedal was is very it's a physical it's physical, man, because you're unloading the truck. Not that I can't do it, but uh especially after hurting my back, man, it definitely definitely weighs on you. And it's not as much money as line haul. Um a lot of people don't like line haul because it's at nights. That was one of the reasons why I didn't like line haul. But like now I I, I do line haul now and bro I, I don't mind it. Like you I drive up to um we drive up we probably do like a, a you know two to three, four hours drive and once you get to your destination, which it will be another terminal in your company, um you work the dock for an hour or two. Being you know, you gotta it goes by seniority, so Depending on where you fall in that, you could be the last person to leave. Like, I've been leaving probably 4.30 in the morning, getting back between, like, 8 um, eight and 10. Put it like that. Um, and you make more money, man. I think, I want to say, since I've been back, I worked four days lying all night. And I made more doing that in four days than I did in the city peddling for five days. So, for me, it's like, I, right now, I, I need the money because I have plans to, like, we're moving. And I'll tell you about that, too. I'm going to tell you about that in a, in a um in another video that I'm going to make. I'm going to start making a lot of videos on here, man, just about the stuff that I do besides trucking. But that's going to come, man. Um, stay patient with that. But, yeah, line haul, you make more money, man, and it's less work. So um, I think before I was saying about with the pedaling in the city, you I was making... I mean, honestly, I was probably making about twelve hundred, eleven hundred um, gross, um, which isn't bad. You know, it's really not that bad. And line haul, you making like, I guess maybe fourteen, fifteen hundred. So you know, you're making a three, four hundred dollar difference. But that adds up, believe it or not. That really adds up. Um, and again, it's just a lot easier, man. And uh, so yeah, I mean, I can't think of the questions that was all asked, man, but you can leave some more on this video and I'll try to answer them for you. Um, but that's what I've been up to, man. And, uh, you know, I'm I'm gonna I'm check in with y'all, man. Get this video up, let me get some views and I'll get into a little more detail about, I might even post a pay stub on here, man. Let me get some likes, subscribe, and, I, and, I, and I'll give y'all a little more insight of what it's like to be in the LTL business. But like I said, man, it's, it, it's tricky, man. But yeah, definitely three things that you're gonna need. You're going to need your hazmat, your tanker, and your doubles and triples. So please get that. I'm going to check back in with y'all, man. It's a, Again, it's your boy T-Storms, a.k.a. J.B. Taylor. That is J.B. Taylor. So I'm going to check in with y'all again, man. Again, leave your, leave your questions, like, subscribe, and I promise you I will get back with another video. And I'm going to give y'all more details about everything that goes on in the LTL business. I might even give y'all insight of what it looks like to be on line hall at night and what we got to do and what it takes to do that. Holla at your boy, man. Again, like, subscribe, and I will get back to y'all, man. Again, I want to thank everybody who watched my videos, everybody who liked my videos, everybody who subscribed. Continue to do that. I'm going to check in with y'all again, man. Holla at your boy. I'm out.